What's happening, turn-based gamers? My name is Lunamaya. Welcome back to the Julii. Last time, we fought the biggest battle of the war so far. The Battle of Massilia. But the battle is not over. We won the first one, but we're not done yet. We've got a second Gallic Horde to deal with. But this time, we are prepared. I've already determined what we're going to do. We're going to send this small force right here. I know that that's not... That's probably going to piss the people off. Actually, they're okay with it. And we're going to move them right onto that bridge. So that way, if they choose to attack, we're going to be fighting a bridge battle. And the bridge battles are the best battles to fight. And I'll show you why once we get there. But meanwhile, we are going to actually... We have a merchant, right? That's right. Yes. So we're going to go ahead. We're going to send him over here. And I'm going to try out this merchant mechanic. And see if we can get any extra money out of that. We're also going to be advancing on Batavium this time. We're going to get in a little town militia going. I think we can actually get one going right now, can't we? Yes, we can. And let's go ahead and do that. Okay, so gold didn't actually attack us for some reason. I don't know why. They got, they, they got the army to do it. Maybe they're too intimidated. That's got to be it. Also, the oh, like, Gallic army is over here. All right, so we got to send this guy over here. What do they got? Oh, just some barbarian mercenaries and the cavalry. We can deal with that. So get the, get all these uh, these guys. I know we're going to uh, affect the public order, but it's just going to be temperamental. Don't worry, guys. Also, where's the... Can I retrain that? I want to retrain that. I want to retrain it. How do I retrain these? I, I don't remember how to retrain units. No, no, that's disbanding. How, how do we retrain units again? Oh, it's right there. Never mind, I got it. All right, so we're gonna send these two out and we're gonna send these four. Actually, we only need three. Let's go ahead and deal with them. Oh, we got them. We got a response. Oh, hey. Oh, boss, this is bad. Oh, we may have just killed some of our own right there. Holy you bollocks. This is bad. This is bad. This is going to be bad. This is really bad. Uh, uh, pause it. Pause it. Pause it. Yeah, we are suffering really bad losses this year. So well, we need to get them back. Just run them back. Um, have the uh, this unit, I guess, reinforce. Actually, wait. 14, but uh, they have a spearman coming up from behind. And so we need, need to get that uh, general out of here. So we're going to have him run. And we're going to go ahead and... We can have, have them... Should we have them come in and reinforce? Maybe we should have them go after this one. Like that. Same thing here. Yep, okay. Actually, make sure. And then these guys. Alright. Yep, these guys come in from the back. They're running. Oh, balls. Hang on. Oh, these guys aren't doing anything. Okay. Well, there's an opportunity for the cavalry. And I'm glad that those barbarian mercenaries are gone. But they are going after that general. They are like going after him. Alright, so counterattack. Go. I don't remember how effective. Great gods be praised. <sighs> okay, we got him. Fear makes a home in our enemy's hearts. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Alright, so they're done. Now pause. Oh gosh, this general. Oh, I put him out way too far. This unit is getting slaughtered. This is bad. This is really bad. Come on. No, come on. Yep. Oh, uh, that was a horrible decision. And this is not turning out much better. Oh, actually, they're gone. Okay. Hey, uh, actually, don't do that. Because uh, we really can't uh, catch up up to cavalry. 
Where's the other one? Oh, it's oh they're chasing after him. Oops. Okay. Uh, don't do that. You guys just come this way. You guys come this way. Oh jeez, that was uh, that was an embarrassment. Oh, we got it back. Okay. Well, we're not gonna get involved again. I don't want to uh, risk shattering them. They have a little bit of PLM left. Let's go ahead and put that back on. Also, run them down. Make sure they don't come back. Now, this should be enough because there's no way a barbarian mercenary could actually beat a Histadi unit. Yep, there they go. Alright, go ahead. Run them down. And, I, and the cavalry is withdrawing. Also, we are, we don't need two to go after the same one. So we're going to send this guy to run them down. And that should be it. We're not going to be done with that. We're, we're going to keep going. Because every soldier we take out now is the less we have to deal with later. And we managed to take Igagalic General out of the picture. So that's always good. Oh, they brought uh, another general this time. That's not a huge deal. I'm confident we can hold them. You know, maybe send like an archer unit or something. But we got plenty of stuff. Actually, can we send another one? Oh, we can. Okay, so we're good. We do need to deal with these pirates. We have so many pirates that we... It's, they're basically ruling the seas at this point. We need, need to start dealing with these things. So we're going to go ahead... Oh dear. Well, there goes that fleet. Yep, I expected that. But we can't withdraw, so guess what? Yep. And, yep, there they go again. Can't do it again. Hey, they still just... Oh my gosh! Seriously? Three straight attacks. We can't... We can't do it with this little thing. An eruption at Etna. Well, too bad for you. And Gold still hasn't attacked yet. The swordsman, we cannot deal with swordsmen yet. We we need to get hit like we need to get Prince of Pace before we can deal with swordsmen. So, and that's why I'm trying to get this going, and so that we can deal with that. We're gonna need we also need a much bigger fleet. Also, we we need to send a diplomat further over. Who have we not? Who have we not spoken to yet? We have not spoken with Parthia, we have not spoken with the Seleucids, we have not spoken with Egypt, or Pontus. Okay, so let's head down this way. We're gonna, uh, no, we're gonna go this way. Oh wait, or can we not go over that way? Maybe we can't go that way. Alright, so I guess we're gonna go that way. Alright. We could also go to Germany. Actually, that's probably a better idea, because we're there's a good chance we're going to end up fighting the Germans at some point. So, go there. Although I already thought... I thought we had already gotten an agreement with the Germans, but apparently not. Oh man, these swordsmen are ruthless. Just look at these stats. Look at this. 8 morale, 11 melee attack, 12 total defense, 3 armor. Compare that to with, with our Hastati... A mere six armor, seven melee attack. We do have the missiles, but but once we get into melee attack, like we're screwed. I mean, we got better armor here, and I think our defense is better. You are, but they have a much better melee attack than the Hestadi ever could. Oh, they got two two warbands now. At this point, I think we need to need to like weigh the risk and go after them because at this point they're probably just going to sit there and try to just build up an army you know try and invade and we and we can't you know, let that happen and so we need to stop that and we'll, we'll let's just see here oh wow 70 though that's barely holding on just one town um, uh, town watch should do it. I don't like using the Hestadi to go after swordsmen because they are so well, well, like they're so well trained. They're like, they're like the heavy units. They, they're literally the heavy units. Imperator. But as as long as we, as we just sit there, the more we sit, 
they're just gonna just build up their army. So we basically have to go for it. Ah, we ambushed one! Look at this. Look at this. They're just walking in a line. Oh man. They had no idea we were there. Oh man. This is going to be a massacre. Okay. I don't know how well this is going to work. But we're going to try. Okay, so these guys go here. These guys go here. These guys. He's uh, just charge and these guys just charge. Why not? Oh, well, there goes the cavalry. Well, that was easy. I mean, we lost a bit of cavalry, though. Oh my gosh. Dude, that was awesome. Look at that! <laughs> that was a slaughter! At this point, we we literally know everything about this army now. Well, it's just a bunch of war bands. There is a unit of druids, which, which are like morale boosters. But really, nothing threatening. And we know everything about them at this, this point. Also, oh, we can retrain this now and get a new one. So at this point... They've basically run out of time. We can now just rebuild that army to what we want. Oh, they left it. They left something. Hang on. Before we send anybody in. Okay. Hey, it's just the general and the swordsman. Oh, well, the two war bands. Was that the ones we ambushed? Oh, okay. So we actually we wiped out half his force. All right, let's do this. Okay, uh, oh, 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 we cannot, uh... oh wait, never mind, I was looking at the wrong thing, all right, uh, uh, we just need one, we don't need anything else, all right, so, you can head, head back there then, we're gonna need to send reinforcements over there, thankfully we do have the ability to do that, right here, uh, over here, we don't, let's go ahead and and lower these he's actually so that way maybe we can actually get to guess the, uh, to the next level same thing with Masilla. that way we can get them to the next level and actually wait well I guess we don't really need to but I do want to increase their population so that way we can start getting principes because principes are way more effective than Hestati oh the governor pal's finished okay uh well if that's the case yes legion barracks i want the principates we need the principates if we're gonna end up have any chance against those swordsmen this is like five turns now and still no attack from gaul we're gonna do an experiment okay we're gonna move them back in and we're gonna see if the gauls are gonna uh, try to attack then because I, I'm, I have a feeling that's what they're, they're waiting for. They're waiting for an opening so that they he can actually try to besiege the city. Which is fine. You know, because if they, even if they besiege the city, we can you know, we can still defend it with the Thermopylae method. For those, who, for those of you who don't know what the Thermopylae method is, basically just block all the streets heading to the town square and you'll be fine attack potavium and we're going to do basically the same plan as we did before we're just going to go ahead and send send them in like this we're going to do this and then we're good okay let's think about this we got plenty of time i don't think there's a timer on this is there doesn't look like there's a timer no there's no timer but just in case pause okay so uh, here's what i'm thinking I'm thinking that we're, we're going to have, have the Hestati all line up like one after the other in this side. And we're going to have the uh, the Equites kind of line up which which side is, is flatter. Looks like this one. So we're going to have the Equites come in on this side with the general behind them to help reinforce. Because... It's like, Equites cannot stand up to a barbarian warlord. There's no way in hell. 
So what we're going to do is just have them go up behind. That way, if they do charge, we'll get the equities immediately out of there. The general will intercept. My biggest concern with this plan, though, is that if the general... Well, like, what if the warlord goes after the Histadi? Like, if that happens, we can't send in the general into support. Because they're going to be all the way on the other side. And we can't, can't just charge them right into the swordsman. So we'll basically have to hope that the Hestati can deal enough damage for them to just run back to the square. Okay, so now they're going in. Okay. So now what we're going to do... All units... Actually, yeah, go ahead. Fire, fire on them. Why not? No, not in melee, you moron! This... Oh, man, they're going to rip us to shreds. Yup, they are ripping us to shreds. We cannot... Nope. Come on! Throw your pilum! This is not gonna work. Yeah, because they're gonna have to run right into the town square. Yeah, because they're going there. And that, as expected, they're gonna end up charging into the back. Come on, guys! Come on, guys! Oh my gosh, this is this is horrible. This was a disaster. This was a disaster. I mean, the swords—it's been our charging us. They're... What? What? That was their king! We killed the king! We killed the king! Holy crap! We. Have... Okay, we might have just turned this battle right back in our favor. The king dead. And they don't have any he, he horsemen left. We have free raid. We got some Pelum going in. Go ahead and use all the Pelum. There they go. Alright, everybody, head in. We did it! Okay. Oh my word. Wow! I did not expect it to go as well as that did. That almost was a complete disaster. Because that general, wow, the warlord, like, they are just so effective against the infantry. We didn't even suffer that many casualties. We he did not suffer nearly as many as I thought we were going to. That battle... Could not have gone better. Well, it could have gone better. But. Wow. I am just in shock. Retrain everything. That definitely was something I probably shouldn't have done. And I will say that. I. We probably should not have gone after Batavium. But. It was weak. Like. Well. To some extent. It was weak. Like. like it only had two units. It's. And we wiped out the other two, so... We're like... If we were to wait again, they would just build more units up. Yep. Most likely swordsmen. And then taking battalion would have become impossible. So we really didn't have much option there. So now, what we're gonna do... Uh, we don't really need the Legion barracks yet. I do want that for them, though. Well, that way we can start getting assassins. Assassins are very helpful if they work. I knew it. I knew that's what they were waiting for. I knew it Okay, well, that's not a problem. We can easily fend that off oh, Especially with the crappy army they've got. They're sending somebody at us. That's bad I'm not taking Corrales Yep, we did that Oh nice Nice and nice. Okay, and Vigilanium has grown. That's nice. All right, burn them all. All right, so Vigilanium has grown. So we'll get that. Actually, let's wait to get that. Let's get all. Let's get the rest of these going first. So then we've got this small force here. Most likely they're going to 
Uh, they're going to try to besiege Batavia. Oh, we don't have access to a stables yet. Oops. Okay, well, in that case, get the stables going. All right, that's almost done. All right, this should be easy win. An average victory? How is that average? Okay, go after them again. Right. There we go. And then go back after them. Okay, they don't have any siege equipment yet. We have not lost anything yet. That's good. Just as I suspected, goal is a besieging Batavia. That's going to be an easy win. Okay, because they only just sent three uh, warbands. That's it. So we're not going to need to worry about it. Also, no thanks. Yes, I know. But probably he. Yep, there's four battering rounds. Nothing to worry about. We did take a little bit of attrition casualties. I think that's what that's called. But this battalion, that's nothing to worry about. Also, apparently we've, they found an agent. Nice. But anyways, wipe them out, please. Thank you. So now go back there. And go ahead. Uh, retrain those, please. Thank you. All right. That's almost done. All right. See if we can find some um, goals here. Nope, we got this though. All right, uh, we'll go ahead, let them attack there. Do we? Uh, oh yeah, auto merge. There we go. That's much more helpful. This one though, <laughs> this is pathetic. What's that? That's a diplomat. Oh, I thought he had a knife. <laughs> no, that's a scroll. All right, never mind. All right, so we're gonna get this. Oop. Come on now. There we go. We're sallying out. Yeah, that's right, Gold. We're, we're heading out there, and we are not coming to say hello. We are not going to let a puny little set of warbands stop our progress. We're going to go there. You guys, this way. You guys, this way. Are you withdrawing? No, you're not withdrawing. Just do that. Just that. I don't know. Are you withdrawing? No, you're just getting out to a more open area. That's fine. And we will do the same. Because I think... Yeah, because Romans prefer to fight on the open plain. So you guys head that way. You guys head that way. That way we can run you down. When, they, when we go after you. Now what we're going to do, we're going to go ahead. We're, gonna send them. we're actually going to give them a bit more compact this time. That way we can actually fire all of our Pelum um, instead of having to rotate them just so they, they can... Oops. No. Just so, so they can fire. They're basically just trying to make a defensive formation. And just so that way every time, wherever we go, they'll have something to meet. But that's fine for us. Because that way we know they're not going to work. Uh, they're not going to try to attack. Until we fire our spears. Or before that. Oh crap! And I forgot to turn the thing off! Uh, or, or on! Damn it! Alright, uh, no. You guys, run away, run away, run away, run away. Okay, there we go. There we go. There we go. All right, do that, do that, go after them. Go after them. There we go. Go after them. You go after them. Hit them from the back. And watch the carnage. Excellent. I love carnage. Absolutely love it. Could have suffered some less casualties there if we maybe had reacted sooner, but my reflexes aren't the best. And so now, because that was the only army in uh, from Norcom, because that army came from Norcom, so now that they have, all we need to do now, I think, yeah, just retrain this, maybe even get another one. 
and then we can just head right out to Norcom and secure our northern border. But that's going to have to wait until the next episode because I am all out of time. We have made some great progress today. We've captured Battalion. We're one sentiment away from securing the north. We've got a threat to the west, but I am fully confident we can deal with that. We hopefully can finally end the Battle of Massilia right then and there with this final assault. And then once that happens and we've secured the north, we can just storm on through the west. But until then, thank you all as always so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. That means a lot to me. If you like what I do and you want to see more, make sure you subscribe. And I will see you all in the next video. But until next time, see you later! Okay, go back now. Back, 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 back. Okay, good. Good job. Good job, boys. We're doing this. I told you not to do that. Oh crap, I forgot that uh, they can only go certain ways if they're going somewhere. And that's going to hurt. There it goes.